morning. You're through to Shelley and Sales Support. How can I help? Up through our Sales Support Luke speaking. How can I help? Good afternoon. You're through to our CFO and Arnold Clark Sales Support. How can I help? Good morning. Through to BMW Underwriting Support. Ross speaking. How can I help? Morning. You're through to Sales Support speaking with Emma. How can I help? So mainly we're dealing with retailers daily, um, but we also deal with a lot of other departments within BMW, um, such as pricing, payout, uh, residue value, financial crime, escalation, the regional manager work very closely with the underwriters. We do need to um, work closely with underwriting, proposals that come through and don't get automatically accepted. Um, we'll go into underwriting and a lot of the time additional information is requested from the underwriters. Sales support work with the financial crime team by conducting the initial triage in the suspected fraud cases that have matched from Hunter. Um, so one person will be on that in the team for the day. Um, they'll go through a constantly refreshing queue of uh, proposals that come through and will match um, usually a customer that's been alerted to us or the authorities. So I've been in sales support for two years now. We're, we are like the central hub for a lot of different queries um, we only talk uh, directly to the retailers so it's whenever they have an issue with anything figure related or campaign related. Phones I'd say are basically a retailer's Google so any queries they have uh, they bring us up and we help a couple of examples of what they call would be e-sign issues, payout queries. It can involve technical queries regarding profiling. It's such a varied role build a really good relationship which I think is really important. If we've got happy retailers we've got a very happy customer. We have a sales support email inbox which is a lot of the time very similar to the queries that come through on the phone. If for example they're looking for a residual value uplift on a car they need to send over proof of why they want that uplift, so it could be extra spec on the vehicle or something, if there was anything that we needed to profile. I think a sales support, I think of three specific areas. Uh, firstly, handling of tactical campaign queries. Secondly, amending expired figures. And thirdly, sorting out RV issues. Sales support proved time and time again what an invaluable service it is they provide, not just to our retail network, but to us as a regional team too. I firmly believe that without sales support being there to act as a buffer between um, underwriting, certainly, and retailers or customers, it would be very difficult to have the productivity from my department that we do.